Hi everyone, so today I wanted to show you my um, makeup organization, kind of how I organize my makeup. Because, hold on, settle down, settle down. Sorry, my cat is with me. Um, he's a little excited right now. <laughs> Please behave! <laughs> okay, okay, he's not going to. Anyways, um, I want to show you how I organize my makeup because I just barely did my makeup collection. Um, so yeah. Basically, I keep it in this uh, purple dresser. Oh, you're so cute. Um, I keep most of it. Some of it I don't. I keep in makeup bags. Thank you, Oliver. This one has loose pigments and broken slash open eyeshadow, so it doesn't get messy in there like it has been. Mascara and falsies. Um, brushes and eyelash curlers, because I have two eyelash curlers now. Um, eyeliners self tanners and Halloween face makeup and these are all bags from Ipsy Grand Bag except for this one. That one is a um lawn comb one that I got at a yard sale. <coughs> so anyways, in the first drawer it always is face makeup. So at first I have blushes and then powders, highlighters, um, more powder, um, primers, um, concealers, moisturizer um, there's a primer, you know, face primer, and then there's some special highlighters and glitters, and then there's foundations, and the focus on my camera is not good. Mm, there we go, that's a bit better. <clears throat> and then there's brushes, so that's basically how the first drawer is organized. I used to keep in the top drawer would be face, and you would have mascaras and eyeliners as well, and that just got way too messy, so just face products for now. And then right here, this one is the most crowded drawer. This is to be eyeshadows. Um, sorry, there's some hair in there. Um, but um, right here, I have the Jaffras. I have the e.l.f. Um, quads. Oliver, stop. See what I have to deal with? Oliver, knock it off. Okay, so anyways, sorry about that. Um, so yeah, I have some e.l.f. stuff. I have my single eyeshadows. And then I have my MAC eyeshadows. And then on the bottom, I have my e.l.f. 144 um, palette. And then I have my NYX Glitter Roddy palette. And then I have my um, um, Wet n Wild Trios, which this um, Sweetest Candy has been my favorite. I've been wearing it most recently. I'm going to do a tutorial with it. Um, and then I have... Oliver, seriously, here. <laughs> now you come over, <laughs> silly boy. Anyways, um, and then I just have the Ross palette. It's a JBL palette. I don't know what that stands for, but, you know, whatever. And then I have the Naked 2 palette, and then the Profusion palette, and then I have two e.l.f. palettes, and then um, I have my two Coastal Sense palettes, the Warm palette, and then the Original 88, and then I just have some... Rimmel London Eyeshadows, Coastal Scents, Glamour X, you know. Um, that's basically how I'm organizing it for now. I think it is, um, I mean, it's a little crowded, but there's still room, and I feel like I can find my eyeshadows a lot easier than I could before. They were kind of just everywhere, and there's broken blushes up here, and there was broken eyeshadows here. So instead of having them, if there's something broken, it's going to go in this bag so that I can still use it and try to fix it, but it won't get the whole thing messy because that's just annoying. So... Oh, you're so sweet. You have like a crusty in your fur. What is up with that, Ollie? What is up with that? I don't know. Okay, so anyways. And then, um, the bottom drawer is lips, obviously. And I actually, honestly, I would wear like the same Jaffra and L'Oreal lipsticks and then Elf lipstick and then a few different lip glosses. I would wear like the same thing like all the time until I finally organized all my lip products and I realized I have a lot of lip glosses, more lip glosses than I thought that I had, and um, a lot more lipsticks and chapsticks. So I went ahead and I organized, and this is from, these are all NYX, all the ones with the black hat right here um, are NYX lip glosses. They came in a 10 piece set that I showed in my haul. All of them here. And um, they don't have names for the colors, but you can just kind of see what colors. And then there were actually six, I think there were six of these elf lip glosses, but I've misplaced the, um, sixth one. Maybe there's five. I think there were six. Oh, we're stopped. 
And um, then I got these four for my birthday a few years ago. Ulta, and then there's some Bath and Body Works. And then there's some more e.l.f. lip glosses. This one is e.l.f. too, but the label rubbed off, so. And then here's my lipsticks. I have some Jaffra. Um, this one is an Estee Lauder. You can kind of see that, Estee Lauder. So, and then, I don't know what brand that is, Jaffra. Um, Maybelline, L'Oreal, and then I have two Wet n Wild lipsticks that I just barely got that I am really excited to wear because um, this one's kind of red and this one's more kind of like a berry pink color. So yeah, and then I have some Burt's Bees and stuff, chapsticks, and then these are chapsticks too, and then I have some lipstick um, glosses. Um, chapsticks, and then I have my e.l.f. lipsticks right here, so that's basically my lipstick drawer, um, well, lip drawer, so, and I like that I'm actually putting things in separate bags, I'm going to figure out an area to put those, obviously not just keep them on my floor, because that's just kind of, you know, not very tidy, so I'm going to um, find somewhere to put those, but I feel like it'll make it a lot easier than having them get in here and get all broken and nasty before, because I had to clean it out, so I like how I've been organizing, and I'll just give you guys the overview once more face makeup eyeshadows and then lips so I hope you guys enjoyed um, kind of me showing you how I organize my makeup and I hope that this was helpful bye guys